When you are watching a cartoon movie made by a professional animator, you might notice a highlight on the characters that brings them into focus as depth and enhance the overall quality of animation. Have you ever wondered how to create a highlight for your own character? It is easy to add a highlight in After Effects or it will be animated. But what about in Moho? Don't worry, it is simple to do without any script or third-party software. It's time to bring your character design to the next level. Just follow along with me and I will show you how. So here is my character that I'm going to work with. And I've done some animation work a little bit. Let me show you. Nothing fancy, just breathing and raising his arms. To add the highlight on this character, simply just go to uh, layer setting and shadows. Turn on this shading on and pick the color whatever you want. For example, I pick white. Let's make the opacity around 37. If I hit okay nothing changed why because we are currently on the display mode so to see press ctrl r boom now as you can see there's already a highlight on the character if you want to add more on the opposite direction yes we can do it under the character layer there are several layers which are our body parts so select all of them and put it into one single group, which I already done in this case. Again, go to layer setting, shadow, turn on the shading on, and set the value accordingly. Change the direction to opposite way. Pressing Ctrl R, now we have highlights from both sides but i want the second light to be in a different color let's say i'm choosing dark and bring down the opacity a little bit okay Control r now we can see that in a different look but we got some issue since the highlight is very sharp the finger is not really working well so let's try to make them a little bit smoother. To do this, go to shadow again and add blur effects a little bit. I'll do the same on the first layer. Just add blur effects. Now it looks much better. Let's try to see in a different action. As you can see, the highlight automatically follows the body shape nicely. Let me share with you the second method. I'm going to remove all the effects on both layers. Duplicate the character layer. On the top layer, change the blending mode to soft light. You can see the color change a little bit, but don't worry. I'm going to bring down the opacity around 70. Keep doing the same process as we did before, but keep the opacity all the way up, which is 100. Now let's look at the result from the first method we can see here the shade of the highlight cover up some part of the stroke and make the stroke fading. And here comes another method. As you can see here, the stroke is vividly appear naturally.
and the shade on the arms, the shade on the hands, on the legs, and the highlight on the boots are looking natural. That is the end of this tutorial guys. I hope you learned something new. If you do, please consider to subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you next time. Bye.